Okay, hi, my name's Femi, I'm 11 years old, and uh, I have Tourette's Syndrome. Uh, when I was eight, I set up something called South London Raspberry Jam, which do, which is uh, a company that runs Tourette's and Autism friendly coding events. Uh, so I've been running them for two years, and I'm, I also set up a blog called Hackafemo, which is now also my I guess my name for everything. Um, so just recently as well, I won the Diana Award, which is my badges up here, for my Turex and uh, autism friendly coding workshops. And just after the Di Diana Award, I went to Bangladesh for 12 days, where I ran 17 workshops, reaching 220 underprivileged young people. <laughs> As well as this, I've ran multiple workshops around other places, uh, as well as at something called MozFest. I was the youngest facilitator in 2015. And I also recently ran my very first Trex only workshops at something called TickFest, which is where loads of people with Trex can come, uh, feel uh, safe in an environment where they can let all their treks out and it's generally in an outdoor area and it's really fun and um, uh, as well as this I also with my pioneer group we we got our code sent into space as part of the AstroPi competition with uh, ESA, ESA, Thomas Peske I think it was and uh, we, we, we got highly commended so we got data from the Columbus module, which is really cool, uh, where we measured frequencies. Um, we're, we're putting together a music score now of the frequencies, which hopefully we can send back to the astronauts on the space station, which I think they'll enjoy listening to. Um, what else is there to say? <laughs> Oh, okay, so I run <laughs> robot workshops. Uh, so I've run robot workshops using the microbit, which is also what I use to run workshops in Bangladesh with. Um, I don't know how many of you will know what the microbit is, but it's a project launched by the BBC, and it's, it was sort of like a small STEM starter kit sent out to every single year seven, then take it, make it say words on the LED matrix, press buttons, give it inputs, and play games against each other. Um, I also use the Crumble, uh, which is a microprocessor, and uh, I use it to control robots in my workshops. Um, 